Hi, I'm Steve. We haven't done a video for a long time. I've popped down to Folkestone on the south coast of Kent. Uh, I thought I'd come and get some wave photos. That's what I want to do today. Um, I had a look at a tide timetable app and it told me high tide was at 11, which is about a quarter of an hour from now. But uh, if you can check this out behind me, you can see it's absolutely not uh, high tide at all. I don't know when that's going to be. Um, I can see over in the distance though behind me that uh, it's nice and windy today, which was the point of coming down. Um, and there's some, some nice waves blowing, so I've got to see whether I can get a spot and uh, get some photos of those. Otherwise, I'm going to have a wander around Folkestone and get some photos, but I'm going to see if there's some waves. Um, and if nothing else, I can uh, sit and wait it out, I suppose. Got a cup of tea with me. Let's uh, rock on and see if I can get those photos I'm after. Beautiful sunny day, though. Look at the harbour. Definitely not high tide though. Okay, folks, and there's two beaches. There's uh, a, a huge pebble beach, a shingle beach, um, but the, probably arguably the most popular is this sandy beach, which we've got. Just spin you around so you can see. We've come on an off day off of work at the end of January or middle of January, 2023. Right now, this is like dog walkers haven, dog walkers paradise. So uh, there's no kids here. It's obviously school time. So, I'm going to wait. I can see there's some surf out there, which is has got the wind catching the top of the waves like I wanted. But I'm not sure where my vantage point's going to be. I was hoping that where I am now, the tide would be higher up. So I'm going to have to see if there's a different app or see if there's a way of finding out what the tide time really is. But it looks like it's coming in because you can't see any damp sand. Well, not a lot. So I think it's coming in. And there are waves I can see crashing over here say where the, the top is being caught by the wind that's what I'm after but I was hoping I'd be able to do it from here obviously I don't want to get caught off caught out by the tide which is why I was hoping to be here at high tide the tide would be going out and I wouldn't get too wet I'm gonna go down to the beach and see if there's something to be had uh, handheld let's catch up with you in a bit down on the beach so get the sun in my eyes so you can see me down on the beach uh, tides definitely coming in the waves are racing up the beach here it's quite shallow so uh, I'm guessing within the hour or something this will be covered but the wind is catching nicely and the waves are backlit we we'll just have to see obviously I've not tried this sort of photography before I've seen some nice photos from people that I follow these waves aren't as big um so say there's obviously not a big storm on today or anything but give me a little bit of practice and i'm outside in the fresh air rather than sitting at home Let's see if any of the images are any good and i'm desperately trying to keep my feet dry because uh, these little waves have a habit of sneaking in and catching me let's see how uh, see how we get on now moved to out of Folkestone. Folkestone was nice. I um, sat on the beach between Sandgate, which is this way, and Hyde. Down the end there, you won't be able to see it, but Hyde Imperial Hotel is on the front. So I'm sat here on the beach. I'm just watching the waves crash on these rocks here, taking a few photos. Uh, I quite like the splashes on that. That's, that's nice. And it's nice when the sun comes out, which it doesn't always do. You can see it's uh, got quite a bit cloudier than before but uh, when the sun comes out again it's lighting the, 
backs those waves really nicely. If I've got some photos to show them to you. Uh, I'm just missing now, look. Uh, let's get back to the camera, speech in a bit. I do wonder if I'm sitting in a bit of a precarious place. I've moved onto the rocks, watch this. When these slap down, it's a great shot. The wind's picked up and the waves are crashing on these rocks. I've come, so I'm looking straight down. Look how spectacular that is, but they roll in right past me here. Now, the rocks I'm sat on are absolutely bone dry, whoa. Absolutely bone dry, except for that little splash right then. I thought I was out of the way. I don't know whether you can see this, but uh, I've got a load of good photos here, but I'm feeling a little bit um, precarious here. So I might move back a bit, but look at the power. That's cool. I thought the waves, I thought the tide was going out, but maybe it's coming back again now. It's been so long, but uh, I'm going to skedaddle out of here and move back a bit. Catch you in a minute. Or uh, this might be the last, you know, this might be the end of the video. I'll wrap it up later. <laughs> when it splashes and catches my feet, I think I'm too close. Let's get out of here. Well, it's been a good day out. I've got loads of photos to go through. I don't know how many. Um, we'll see how many of them are really good. Um, it's been nice between Folkestone and Hyde. I've been now taking a few photos of different places. I'll leave you with the sound of the crashing surf over my shoulder. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time.